I'm Jacob Holmes, number 74 for the York Simcoe Express, defense from Alston, Ontario. Uh, Jacob Holmes is a versatile two-way defenseman. You know, he's dangerous with the puck on his stick in open ice. Um, that being said, he's also very good in his own end. He's, he's uh, willing to take the body when he has to, um, but he's very, very tactical in his defensive play. You know, he likes to be on the right side of the puck a lot, uses stick actively, and probably one of his biggest attributes, though, is his uh, play on the offensive blue line. Uh, he's just a, a solid two-way defenseman, uh, very heavy shot, uh, huge upside on him. Uh, he's got some good feet and moves pucks out of the zone very well. Uh, I think I'm a two-way defenseman, like to jump into the play and also shut down on D2. Model your game after anybody? Uh, Aaron Ekblad plays a solid two-way game, very good in the defensive zone and the offensive zone as well. What would you say is the strongest part of your game right now? Uh, probably my first pass out of the zone. I make a good first pass and after that I can jump into the zone and join the forwards of the fourth man. You know, I've seen a lot of defensemen shoot pucks from the blue line into shin pads. Jacob has that ability to, to make a step left or right and get the puck on the net. He might not have a lot on it, but he gets a lot of pucks on nets and he scored a lot of goals this year just by A, getting the puck on the net through screens and the goalie doesn't see it and he either scores or creates rebounds. What are a couple things you're going to work on in the offseason to prepare for the next level? Uh, foot speed, close up my gaps and get quicker in the corners, go get pucks in the corners, retrieve better and get the first pass up. Who's had the most influence on your career? Uh, probably my parents. My parents have always drove me to the rinks, early morning practices, always helped me out, bought my sticks, everything like that, so they, they've been really big for my hockey career. Being part of Team Ontario, the Canada Winter Games, what was that experience like for you? Unbelievable experience, great group of guys, great coaches, just a lot of fun. Uh, it was just great to be a part of it. What do you take away from an experience like that? Uh, probably just to play against the best kids in Canada. Uh, it's a very fast style of play. It was very good and it was just a lot of fun to be part of. Uh, I think it improved his confidence. Um, getting selected uh, it is pretty special to be on a, a team like that. So I think that really boosted his confidence. And then and getting to play with all the elite players in, in Ontario really, really helped him. I know he enjoyed the experience, so definitely made him a better player. If, if you could pick a, a fantasy D partner, currently playing or retired, who's that D partner? Um, probably Aaron Ekblad, to be honest. Just I like the way he plays, big guy, good shot, locked down on D2. It's awesome, yeah. Sounds good. He's, uh, he's the captain of your team. What kind of a, what kind of a leader is he? Uh, he's a good off, on and off ice leader. Um, I got to know him last year. He was with us. Uh, so we had no doubt going into this year that he was going to be our captain just by the way he leads by example, comes to the rink every day uh, to get better, and, and that's what we want here. What will it mean to you when you hear your name called on draft morning? Uh, it's been a dream of mine since, ever since I started playing minor hockey. Uh, it'll just be amazing. Uh, just to go anywhere in the draft, it'll just feel great. Yeah. His upside is very big, in my opinion. Um, but, but his hockey sense, his ability to move pucks, and, and like I said, he's got one of the heaviest shots in the age group. Uh, so when he gets, gets some time and space to use that, it's effective. Uh, Jacob will be able to step on a roster next year be because of because of his puck skills um, and, and his skating ability. You know, he's got the puck on his stick. He moves it well. Um, he's always making good tape to tape passes. Uh, the game nowadays is you know get the puck, move the puck, join the rush. And Jacob does all those things. You know, and he's got a great uh, he's got a great skill set and a great hockey sense as well to uh, step in next year.